Hi, my name is Michael Minna. I'm an assistant professor at the Harvard School of Public Health and Harvard Medical School in Boston. And my lab studies uh, what are the long-term uh, immunological impacts of measles. So we're primarily interested in asking the question, when a child gets measles, are they susceptible to other infectious diseases? And generally what we found is after a child actually does become infected with the virus, with measles virus, over the following two to three years, they're actually at increased risk for all other infectious diseases. And ultimately what we found is that before measles vaccination was existing, uh, measles may have been associated with up to 50% of all childhood infectious disease deaths. And that was published a couple of years ago and we've been following this up, looking at uh, a lot of immunological studies in these children who get infected with measles. And all signs point to these devastating long-term effects of measles that fly under the radar from our clinical perspectives, but ultimately can be extraordinarily devastating to measles-infected children.